Hey man, it's Robbie here. You know where I'm at. This is Ebisa Circuit. Everybody already knows, but Ebisa Circuit actually is open track for a lot of people. You pay a few thousand yen to come to the track to be able to drive, test out your cars. So a lot of pro drivers and guys that are actually doing shakedowns, testing, whatnot, uh, happen to come here to test out their cars. Um, usually for the new season or if they change something drastically in their car, um, replace their motor, whatnot. So today I'm here actually to kind of do a little sneak peek for um, not the new guy, but then the old guy coming back actually to the FD uh, USA series, Daigo Saito. Um, he's bringing a Toyota GT86 to the US and he's going to do his second actual shakedown. Uh, he did one a couple weeks ago in Fuji. The car is going to be shipped soon um, from here, Japan, to the USA. And this is probably going to be his last testing. So uh, before the car leaves Japan, uh, I guess I'll try to get some of the some footage. Huh? Yeah, you should. Daigo, uh, I'm gonna ask him a couple of questions about his new car and going to FD. Oh, do FD? Iko don nata kedo. Shashiguri dan desu kedo. Kuruma toriyasu dekita de. Kyo, ma daitai kuruma hashitte OK dattara mo raishu Amerika ni omimasu. OK, so na. FD ずっと出たかったもんね。まあ一回また戻りたかったんですけど、まあ今回チャンスがあるんで、まあ、戻ってやるだけやってみます。車の大まかな仕様はあの、まあ、とりあえずえー、っとまあ今回もトヨタから86をやろうということで。3種の賃金は、まあ、今回前回と違って今回新しく、まあ、最近やってるのは、まあ、アンチラグでターボのラグを減らすシステムとあと、まあ、ノスは前も使ってるんですけどあとはフラットシフトクラッチを使わないでギアチェンジできるような、まあ、レーシングカーでやってるようなやつを使おうと思ってます。はい So this thing is going to be a rocket ship. It's got everything on it. It's got nitrous, flat shift, um, anti-lag. It's got a 3.4 liter Brian Power stroker kit. This car actually came from Toyota, Australia. Like they could have bought. Ah, some of them are Japanese Toyota. Australia no race they're using that car. So this is actually a right-hand drive uh, 8.6 that came to Japan. They got him the car. They're like, let's do the 8.6 instead. 
um, you know, all the hypes out there about the Supra and stuff like that, but they decided to do the 86. Gonna be a killer car. A little different from what he drove before, but he's going back to the US to try and get his championship. I don't know what the champion is. Yeah, so 2012. So he's back. It's been eight years since he's been away from FD, and he's been uh, seeking to get back. Super excited to see his car run and super excited to see him back in competition in the US. America no fan ni hitogoto. That's it, Grandpa just talked, spoke the truth, he's gonna be back. It's gonna be really exciting. New combo, um, he's never actually competed in an 8.6, so I'm really excited to see. He, he tweaked some stuff on this car. It's very different from everybody else's 8.6. You know, every driver and uh, team has their style, but then the car is very Daigo-ish. So during the testing, his exhaust fell off. Well, nothing didn't fell off. The car's really low, so it was dragging. The exhaust fell off, so I think the tab broke off or something, so they're fixing that right now. Uh, meanwhile, let me go ahead and explain some stuff about his car. He's on work wheels, 10.5J minus... Ippai? Yeah, minus Ippai. <laughs> and he's got the dual uh, brakes with uh, fuel suspension. And also Wise Fab um, front and back arms. Wheel with brakes all the way around. Wise Fab. Um, his is modified. But to be honest, uh, everybody's running quick changes. But he is actually sticking with the original Toyota rear end, the dip. So these are pretty much the same LSDs as the JZX chassis, JZX90, JZX100. Uh, a lot of the Toyotas have them. They are capable of handling 1,000 horsepower plus. So it's actually really strong from the factory.
So I think that was a very good test session he had. Um, at the end, um, his alternator belt um, popped off, or actually shredded off. Um, his exhaust fell off. Um, they're just doing a couple of minor um, tuning adjustments. Everybody will see this car at the beginning of April for the Formula Drift USA Series on the first round in Long Beach. And I think uh, we were able to cover the car a little bit, so hopefully you like you guys liked it. Um, please don't forget to su subscribe um, and let me know uh, in the comments if you want to see anything else. Um, we'll try to or as much as possible but thanks guys thanks for watching